Uh, you've both come back from your year abroad, and you've now just come to the end of your final year of the course. Mm -hmm. How did you use your year abroad experience in, in your final year classes? Um, I think everybody has a change in attitude towards their own learning process, i.e. Mm -hmm. they realise what kind of benefits the languages will bring to them in their future careers and in their future lives. So it's, I would say on the whole, everybody's more kind of enthusiastic and positive about the language, but I, I mean, I said earlier, my Spanish uh, was the language I picked up at Abinicio at Royal Holloway, the other two I did from post A level. Um, and it really, the PRA helped me hugely with manipulating the language and being able to cope and, and hopefully <laughs> do quite well in my final year courses. Um, and so it holds huge benefits, not only for the future, but also for your final year studies. It really is the right time to go and do it. And, and you can see why, as much as it, it's a lot of planning and a lot of paperwork, it's hugely beneficial and you can see when you come back why why it's that why it's an integral part of the course and, and why you should do it. Definitely. I'd also say that whilst you're there, perhaps you're not realising how much you are actually improving. And it's when you get back and do your PRA all or you start classes again that you realise how much you've actually learned and how much you've come on. Um, and I think that's a, it's a great it's a great feeling when you come back and you realise how beneficial your year abroad has actually mm. been for your language and for yourself. I think intellectually it's really benefiting students as well. So you have you acquire this linguistic ability to speak much more fluently and understand the grammar. But also you learn about the culture in which you're living. And I think that's what students really get out of it when they come back because a lot of our content courses are based on cultural production, so literature and history mm -hmm. and visual arts. Yeah. And they feel in class that they can really contribute towards discussions because they've lived in that culture, they've learned about it, they've effectively sort of lived as part of a citizen of that uh, foreign culture. So I think in many respects it, there is that sort of benefit. But also it's fun. I mean, students come back mm -hmm. with a variety of stories of travelling during their holidays mm -hmm. and summer holidays or making lots of uh, Spanish, German, French, Latin American friends who become friends for life. They then sort of continue to maintain that friendship and go back after they graduated or, yeah. or sort of they come and visit here. So it's kind of a, really it's like a, a life changing experience for a lot of our students mm -hmm. in many ways.